Hey guys, Witchy Cat Lady here in Dragon Adventures, of course, and I'm going to show you more on how to use the alt account for the coconut farming as a follow-up, a part two to the other video we did the other day. If you have not seen it, I'll have it pop up at the end in one of the corners so you can check that out. But let's switch over to that real quick. So what I want to show you is just how quickly we can get these alts in and out for coconut farming. So we're going to start here when we log in. So go ahead and hit play and it teleports us in to our world. I'm closing the chat box just so it's out of the way. And here you can choose to go over and get your spin wheel if it's ready. Mine is not. You don't even have to do the spin wheel if that takes up too much time. So go ahead and get out a dragon that is grown that you can ride and then we get on it and away we go down to the farm plot soaring down just go down wherever land hit your claim all boom done and if you don't have the uh, robux to get the claim all then you'll have to walk in and manually harvest them it is faster if you can get that and you see we're done in a matter of a couple of minutes now the other part I want to show you is how this can be self-sustaining. As you can see, we only have 171 coins and a few coconut plants. Well, I've collected a few coconuts so far, 256, which doesn't seem like much, but it is coconut day. So let's go over here and sell these 256 coconuts and get what coins we can. And there we are, we've gotten 10,752 coins and we've completed a mission which gets us an additional 500 coins because we earned 500 coins. No, it was 200 coins. We get an additional 200 coins for earning 500 coins. Yeah, got, got a little mixed up there. So now we have 11,123 coins. We want to go use that to buy more coconut plants because we still have a pretty empty plot. And right now I am not using a boost for the farming because this account doesn't have any more robux you don't have to use a boost but it does increase the coconuts that you can harvest especially if you can only log in once maybe twice a day even if you can't log in every day so i've managed to get more coconut seeds 22 more so what i'm going to do is obviously plant these and then i've still got a good bit of time until the farm merchant resets so I am going oops I am going to log this account in one more time before the farm merchant resets and sell all of these coconuts from all of these plants so that I can get more coconut plants to be harvesting until the next coconut day and on the next coconut day I'm going to sell coconuts again so that I can continue to buy as many plants as I need I do plan to get the advanced builder plot on this account eventually. I am going to make sure that I have coconut seeds to fill at least part of it before I buy it to make the purchase worthwhile. Now again, just a reminder, if you want to increase your harvest, you would go to the premium shop, boots, boosts, not boots, <laughs> and the double crops. It will give you twice as many coconuts or whatever plant you're planting every time you harvest. And that's really all I have to show you for this video. As you can see, I've filled up my entire plot doing this method. And yes, I did use this method on my main account. I actually originally started with quite a variety of plants. Sorry, Demon Raptor, you're going to poof. Because I have all the worlds unlocked and I did start my farming before I got to prehistoric. I originally had a couple of apple seeds and a variety up to like pumpkins and eventually once I had a good amount of the more expensive ones I started replacing the lower levels with the more expensive seeds and same once I could afford coconuts I bought coconuts to fill any empty plots and then gradually uh, honestly over uh, months I started replacing the others as I got money to do so and as you can see it has paid off I have a short out that I uploaded just uh, 
ooh, 12 hours ago as the recording of this show, and I got 20 million coins on the last coconut day. And after upgrades and a couple purchases, I still have 2 million. What purchases did I do? Well, I got a few ghost potions down in the player marketplace, and I got a cool dragon that I did not have in Legendary. It is a 5 mutation Legendary color Feyre that is slowly loading. Here we go. Isn't this cute? It has the Eclipse element. Show us your color change. Look at you. It was actually neon when I got it. I shifted it to glass. The neon is a bit bright. I'm very selective of my colors with neon. But I hope this video helps you guys. Stay tuned for more. Please like and subscribe and turn on those notifications. I will see you guys in game or another video. Bye.